think the essence of this event is what is it, what are the important points that help you to become a young entrepreneur? We all worked in the enterprise field, we wanted to do something enterprising for postgraduates because we didn't feel there was anything really out there that targeted them directly. I think what we're, we're hoping students to get out of today is that actually developing a business uh, and being entrepreneurial doesn't, isn't actually that difficult, it doesn't have to be a, a tough process. This is the nuts and bolts. A lot of experienced people who started their own business, started them young, what have they done to make their business a success? And this today is all about passing those skills and those ideas on to other people. I think we're trying to give people an overall idea of what maybe starting your own enterprise or to be more enterprising is all about. So we're really interested in making sure that people uh, um, try different things and uh, the workshops are all about that. The sort of benefits we're going to get from today's event, I suppose, is um, finding out more about social media. That was one of the events I went to this morning how you can build up an online presence, let people know what you're doing, what you're interested in, um, possibly let them know how you, they can help you as well. There's lots of people out there who are quite willing to help you. Oh, well, so far we've had one seminar about guerrilla marketing, low-cost marketing, obviously very useful if you're a new startup, you don't have a lot of money. So that was very good. The guy talked for about an hour and it seemed like 20 minutes. The guy was a genius, so that was really useful. No matter how great your idea is, you've somehow got to tell people about it. You've got to market your idea you've got to essentially get it out there so people know your product or service exists. It's fantastic to see so many people here and so many different entrepreneurs networking uh, and mentoring the group. Networking is inv invaluable, it's just it's the best thing to do if you're wanting to go into business, especially someone like me straight out of uni, what you want to do is get networking, find people that are like-minded, find people that have a passion like you and find people that also really can help you on your journey. This kind of networking where you're just left to your own devices it's much better than going to their formal sit-down lunches, you're limited to who you meet. But this kind of free-for-all, much better. Also, we got put in allocated groups, so you never know who you meet. You could meet people here today that could help you um, whatever route you take. You could get ideas today that could help you whatever route you take. And most importantly for me, you could gain and develop some skills here today that will help you make decisions and to develop your future um, whichever way you decide to go. I definitely recommend coming to an event like this. Um, you get to meet some interesting people and hear some really interesting and informative speakers. Um, and it also gives you time to, to reflect on where you are in the business process if you're just setting up what kinds of things you might want to, to look at doing next. You're never ever too late to start your own business. I think that's one of the great things and, and there's no right or wrong answer. So however you choose to do it is the, the way you choose to do it. But there's loads of support available both from university and other organisations who want to help you. If people were to take away just one thing from today, it would be, I can do it. I can do it. It's a hard road, but I can do it. Hopefully, um, I mean, the... The ERDF project that I work on as part funded um, today's conference uh, and we're hoping that the delegates of today will be the business startups of tomorrow.